G'day guys, it's Kelvin from the Catching Company Museum. I'm outside on this beautiful sunny day. Uh, it's quite early. But one of the first things I do is I check my emails. And a man sent me an email asking if I knew what some of the vacuum hoses are on his engine. And he did say he'd checked on my channel, which I, I really do appreciate. But he still wasn't sure where these vacuum hoses go. So I thought I'd better get out and check the animals and feed my pigs and then we'll do a, a video on the on the vacuum hoses. So these, these are my little piggies and being piggies they make mud but after they've had their first breakfast of grass which they're eating at the moment I'll go out in the paddock and they'll get their second breakfast and they'll be prepping my uh, garden. We also have an extra little resident, he's an avocado that uh, we feed to the piggies. And uh, Mr. Rat lives under there, and, and his days are numbered, a bit like these guys, because um, they are food. But we treat them as good as we can before we eat them. Hey guys, ah, they're actually girls. Right, let's look at some cars. Right, we're going to start with my own LS430. It's a bit beaten up, but it's cheap. Uh, and we're going to look at these hoses here. So we've got. This one here goes off to the VSV for the purge system. We've got that one there, which is for the PCV valve. And we've got this one that's blanked off, and we've got this one that's blanked off. And some models on the LS400s, that's the PCV, and this is blanked off, so those, those two can be interchanged. But you'll see that the photo, it has an extra hose in it. It's in here somewhere, uh, and looking at it, I'm thinking he's got the different throttle body too. It's, it's a little hard to tell, because I think you, you get like this much, you can't. But I think he's got the six-speed throttle body. Um, <clears throat> I did look at it on my phone, so the photo was a bit small. We also have this, this hose here. See that one up in there? And it comes down here, and there's this, this hose here. Heading, heading down there. Ooh. Uh, I've got one other video about that down into there, of course, and those are for the idle up for the power steer. I'm going to note this hose here out of the breather box. Um, very prone to these snap off in here. Oh, sorry guys, I was interrupted uh, tuning a car in the USA. Hmm. Right, uh, where do we get uh, this one? Really, really prone to breaking off here. Um, so replace that one, okay, and then it makes this air box, air intake, easier to remove. Same as this, replace them in the PCV grommet. But we'll notice on this car, it doesn't have the hose that was noted in that picture. And it's because these are different, some of these engines, and um, that can cause problems for a few guys. Right, we're going to go to this one. So this is another five speed. So this is the one that I did the replace these hoses on. It's got the one on the top. Now that's not going to solve our problem. Right, let's go to the six speed. Right, so this one is a, a JDM six speed Celsius. How can we tell it's a six speed? Look at the throttle body. It's got the big plug on it. And look, it's got the hose that we wanted. There it is, look at it. So we've got PCV valve hose. And uh, that was stuck over there. Uh, so PCV hose. There's our breather for the purge. And there's this hose that we were talking about. But notice up on the top of the intake manifold, look. No hose going into the top. But we still have that one going off the side down there. And by this point, we've probably got a bit of good, a good idea that it's going down to the idle up for the power steer um, power steer system, the idle power steer idle up valve, which is which is down there. And those have been fitted to Lexus's since uh, 1989. On uh, crown and then of course on the LS 400s from 1990 so but this is not a new thing and these this car's a 2004 
So um, it's a, and it's fitted to lots of Toyotas. Right, I think it all, that's all the main vacuum hoses, isn't it? That's all, all the main. Yep. Right, let's go have a look and um, some diagrams and have a look at that bit of a system. So guys, uh, I'm also trialing something a bit new and it's coming really soon. I'm already in the process of making some videos that, but I'm going to give a bit of an example. I'm doing um, some members only videos and they're going to have additional information like I'm about to do in this video. But this is a public one. It's going to be free and I'm still going to keep doing free videos. But if you want even more and more information, make them even boringer, um, then look out for the member only videos. But let's go inside. All right, guys, of course, I've done a video on this particular website and you'll notice when I push the sign in, um, it makes me sign in and um, that will make the difference between having pictures and not having pictures. If you don't have a login um, and you haven't had an invite, then you won't get pictures. So log in, find someone that can give you an invite. Uh, I'm getting low, but I've got mates that can help out. Okay, I'm not, I can be found on Facebook. The Cartoon Company a Facebook page can be found and liked, and then you can send me a message there, and we will sort it. Um, I'll call out to my mates around the world, and they'll help out with invites. Right, uh, we need to get into that six-speed car, 89661. Um, now, you can normally go in through... Um, yeah, like through the vehicle identification. Oh, you know what I forgot? 5 0. 5 0 is um, LS or Celsius. General uh, LS 430. That's actually the one I use for Cullum's car, which is a six speeder. My one must be 800. So we click on here and we click on there. Brings up, I've gone straight into the electrical because it's on the ECU. And I am moving fast here, and I'm going for ugly ads. Um, we're going to vacuum lines, which is under en engine. Here's ventilation hoses. Um, so there's the hose to the airbox. There's the PCV hose. Okay, good. It's not where I want to look. Vacuum piping. Bam! Look at that. That's what we want. So in here, we have got, there's the breather for the purge solenoid. We've got that other video. Here's the ACIS. I've got other videos on that as well. Look, here's what we're looking for. Here's um, imaginary, we, the throttle body is there. Here's the hose here, look, and it's coming down here. There's that idle up for the power steering, and there's the hose that comes up to the earbox. This is what I'm going to be including in more of my videos. And, because this, you guys can work this stuff out for yourself, but I'm also doing a lot of wiring and pinouts and wiring system analysis and showing how these systems work. Okay, so um, when I talk about being more boring, it's only boring if it's not into uh, what you're into and, and what you're wanting to learn about. For the guys that are going to be doing wiring and repairs and systems and part numbers and all that, then... I only joke about it being boring. Um, so, I uh, hope that gives you an idea. Now, I have that video of those vacuum hoses on my channel. So when people ask me this question, I can send it. Um, another thing I'm trying to work out is how to get this information where guys are looking for these hoses to the people that need it. Okay, so if you do watch this and you do see other people asking on Facebook and internet, all the pages you're on, hey, please share my video around so more people can see this, okay? Uh, I've had my breakfast, I've edited a video, I'm going to feed my pigs, put them, feed them again, second breakfast for the pigs, and put them out in the paddock so they can spend the day in this beautiful sunshine. Girls, let's get you out of here, to the paddock. So every day, unless it's really, really wet, these guys head out to the paddock. So 
Sorry, I didn't open the gate. Hello, Mess. And pigs are incredibly intelligent. Uh, need to be as intelligent as a dog, actually. Let's go. Let's go. And I've got the electric wires there. Protected them from one of my gardens, my other garden at the back of the house. And we do this every day. And this is going to be my new garden, which my pigs are making, making, uh, plowing it up for me. Here we go. And this one, here I'll show you. We get the, if she gets in what she wants to eat. Hey, hey, you need here? Here you go. She's worked out that it's much easier just to eat it straight out of here. There you go, girls. Right, they'll spend the day in the sunshine. They've got their little house. Sheep out on the hills. And they'll grow nice and tasty. Right, hope that's been helpful. Video's done. Into work. Catch you later.